The search is on for a venue where motor racing enthusiasts in St. Lucia can call their home. A delegation from the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, headed by Minister the Honorable Kenson Casimir, took on a tour of several possible locations where motor events could be staged safely and comfortably. Other relevant parties were part of the visits to ensure a more suitable location was found. Today we've visited some of the sites in the south that the members of the association have identified as possible areas to have uh, motor, motor racing, whether it's cars, whether it's drag racing, uh, whether it's obstacle racing and, and the likes. And I'm very pleased to say that they are very enthusiastic about ensuring that they get to a location that is comfortable for everybody. We are in the south because I think motor events are very popular in the south, more so than the north. And for me, I'm making every effort to, you know, as I said in most of my speeches, go to the areas that have the events actually ongoing and further develop it. And I think it would be very good if we can find a location in the south. Of course, the development of DSH has displaced these individuals that are interested in the sport. And for me, as Youth Fund Sports Minister, it's incumbent on me to ensure that we, we help them with their, their plight. President of the St. Lucia Racing Association, Craig Gustav, says his membership is keen to have a facility where they can get back to a level of competition after a long period without a suitable venue for motor racing. Our objective today was to actually locate uh, a, new, a new location so that um, we can create, call a home for the St. Lucia Motor Racing Association. Um, We've been trying to, 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 to cope with the, the lack of facilities for the last, for the last how many years. Um, and now with DSH coming in, we've now been actually forced to move from what we know as the Kakabef. Um, we have a lot of, of, of avid racers here. And um, what we are trying to do is now to give, give us, the racers, a place to actually call home and to, 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 to be able to express how our, our hobby, how our, sometimes some, some of us use it as a livelihood as well. A choice of location should be determined soon and the relevant interested groups are banking for a location close to the traditional site at the former Beanfield Airstrip. From the Ministry of Youth Development and Sports, I'm Ryan O'Brien.